Hello guys, this is Direct History bringing you my first tech tutorial on this channel and they're going to be a short tutorial and today's is make how to make a basic quarry. If you like the video or if it actually worked for you and it helped you, please could you subscribe as it means a lot to me and also it shows that my my tutorials are working for you guys and it gives me a bit of self self um, joy really kind of so yeah um if you co if you want to know any other tutorials then please comment in the description on any of them and maybe if you subscribe say man I'll say thank you to you so today is going to be how to install the quarry mod uh, not quarry how to install how to make a basic quarry and this is it's not basic but if I can show you how to make a basic one if you want to really as well now you'll need if you're doing the one that I'm doing you, you'll need six coal or six sacks of 64 coal you'll need six uh, steam engines you need one quarry uh, uh, one lever um, uh, some insulated wire some cobblestone pipes and some redstone if you need and all the uh, craft recipes will be will be in the bottom right hand um, corner of the video when I um, put place down the block so this is the quarry and block and as you can see it makes these um, lines around the outside of this this is the diameter of your hole that you're digging so first what you want to do is you want to place down the steam engine so one there and one there this is the basicest one you can do so say if you've only got redstone and you're early up in the game then what you can do is you can just go one t oh I need some more redstone sorry guys um redstone 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 poor me I, I use it so much that I just can I forgot about it and then what you do is you just link it up with a lever in the middle and then you would place in your coal into your steam engine both of them and then you'd right click the uh, lever and it would start pumping and then it would start doing the, fi the thing that you want to do but this isn't as fast as what it can be so what I'm going to show you how to do is show you how to do the fastest and this is good for you if, you, if you've got the um, got the uh, if you've got the red alloy ingots for it and also if um, if you're in creative mode so if you don't want to spawn stuff no if you don't want to do it survivally so what you want to do you want to get your extend your steam engines to three on each side so and then you want to fill them up with your coal so let's do that coal 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 and now with your red alloy wire, so we've got some, I'm just checking if we've got enough, so I'll just add some more onto it. And you, all you want to do is you want to l make sure that they're all connected in a line. And then you want to connect them to your lever. Ooh. And you want to, why isn't this working? There you go. Sorry, my computer's a bit slow today as I tried to record this video about 10 times already today. And you right click with the lever and it will start pumping all three of them and then this is so much more quicker and you'll know when it's done as this orange um, this orange glass quarry stuff will go all the way around and then it will start mining when these the only problem I'd say one thing you worry about is you've got to as you can see on these steam engines you can see this blue um, this blue uh, this blue light or whatever if this means that it's working well and it's fine and it's not overheating. If it's green, it's starting to get overheated. If it's red, then it's overheated and risks explosion. And then what you want to do if it's that, you'd right click the lever and then wait for it to turn blue again and then you'd start pumping again. So you better not leave this unattended unless you unless you're fight unless you have a um unless you just um don't worry about it. So what you want to do next, say to make it more automatic, because you're going to be mining out blocks, you want to get your cobblestone pipes, as you can see here, and then you want to put them on top of your quarry, oh, quarry blocks, so that it's going to creative mode so I can fly. And then you just want to, I don't know what you want, I, I say you want to take it away from the quarry, and then you can take it away from the quarry, and then you can place it down here. And then if you have a uh, what's a chest? I didn't, I didn't have a chest, damn it. So and then also then you can put a place a chest. And then all the items that you when you start when it's finished and starts mining, all these items gets pumped up. This goes away along here, all the way along here, and gets pumped into your chest. And this is this is the basic quarry. And I'll just 
stop. I'll just pause the video here. Oh no, here it is. Here you go. So you'll it will go to the this corner, the corner your right, your bottom right hand corner from the quarry, and it'll start mining. It will go for each layer. But what I recommend you do, so it doesn't break, also place some water down and place um, a bucket of water, and then in in all corners, and then and then it will um, stop any lava like burning the uh, drill. So here, as you can see, here's the dirt getting pumped up, and it's going to be pumped into this chest. So this is the this is the this is the as you can see, it's changed to green, and it's doing this. This, this means maximum. Um, maximum efficiency so it's working really well and reds when you get worried a bit because I see it's pumping out even stronger so if you had the redstone with one engine it would be going up slower and it would also not be going as fast and this this goes all the way down to bedrock and it stops the bedrock and what you can do is you can change the transport pipe so you have a diamond transport pipe and then you can make diamonds and any decent ore go into there so um, the next video I'll probably do is on transport pipes or any other video you want me to do. So, this has been how to make a um, a ticket quarry, and I hope you enjoyed the video. Please comment, and subscribe, and don't forget about this. The colors changing, and I'll see you soon. Goodbye.